Hey, 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 everyone, here's a quick androgynous drag tutorial. Make sure you subscribe for more. So you're going to first lotion and moisturize your face. And then after that, add foundation. And I like to add some red to bearded area to blend that in and cover it just a little bit. As you can see here, some red and some foundation. And then you're going to blend it all in, as you see. So I blended all that foundation around my face and the red as well. Everywhere you can still see some red, but that will change once I add more and blend it and once you're done with that you can add your highlight and your contour to your desired areas to form whatever shapes you like i use some light colors here just for the look i was going with but i will add a darker color after you can always change your contour so here's what i do shape it up and then let it cook sit for 10 15 minutes after you let it sit then it's ready to blend and you can blend it real nice with a blender switching um, spots on it so you don't um, sometimes you can mix it depending on the paint and it comes out interesting but make sure you subscribe if you haven't already for more content and to watch me grow but here we go so after you blend that in you can see it's not much contour showing so I wanted to add a different contour so here we go Blue. I wanted a little darker look for my androgynous look because I'm messing with horror looks. This isn't my best work, but I still thought I'd share it because, I mean, it's a learning process and we all learn together. So as you see, I added my contour to the nose, to specific bearded areas, to the temples and cheekbones. Then I blended them into shape, as you can see. So now I have some bearded contour, a blue bearded contour, and a white highlight, if you notice, in all these areas. Um, and then, once you're done with that, reshape, add as needed, and boom! You can add eyeshadow, lipstick, eyebrows, um, mustache if you want. Feel free to have fun, try your own colors. For this one, I didn't really have to paste my eyebrows, which I really enjoyed. I really kind of liked filling them in and making this happen. And then the mustache as well, I didn't have to paste that down or cover it too much. It kind of just filled in. I like this look. It's not my best, but it's still fun. So try your own colors, have fun, and make sure you subscribe if you haven't to see my pole journey and my makeup journey as the pole dancing drag queen. Thank you so much for watching. As always, have fun. Let me know if you want to see anything. And please subscribe and like and let me know what you think. Be safe, y'all. Love one another. Take care. Thank you for watching. Bye.